You broke into our home to take pictures of ghosts? Yeah, this place looks haunted. I thought it was an abandoned house. No one seems to know who actually lives here. So I just assumed. Hmm. And that's when... Everybody, look! He's got puffy cheeks just like me! So you thought this place was haunted? Well, I guess that's how people usually uh. see this house. We love this property, huh? so we had the house built very quickly and moved in right away because we were so excited to live here. I see that now, so there are no ghosts in here. Oh! <laughs> see? Like me! Just like me! His cheeks are puppy! My cheeks are puppy! You just can't be walking into other people's homes. You saw my sister naked. You do know that's a crime, right? You could be charged for this. That's illegal entry, sir. And a physical assault on a person of the female persuasion. Anyway, you're a boy, so you should understand the implication of what you've done, of seeing a woman naked. You should apologize. Oh, it's all right. Uh, it's not something that I would lose, Mai. It's a good thing nothing was lost. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's right. We haven't even introduced ourselves yet. My name is I, and this is my younger sister, Mai. Good to know ya. And that's my youngest sister, Me. Hi, I'm Me. Happy to meet you, puppy cheeks. And this is Maya. She's our maid. Sir, I am Maya. I have prepared some green tea. Unagi, come meet our new friend. Luna! This is Unagi, our pet fairy. Luna, Luna, Luna! No, Unagi, this is my puppy cheeks. not puppy cheeks. It's Daichi. Daichi? Daichi, huh? Well, what is it exactly that brings you and your camera to our haunted mansion? <gasps> Daichi, would you be able to tell us why? Why you are trying to take some ghost photographs? Oh, I think that I understand it all now. Daichi, you have a crush on that Asuka girl, huh? So tell me, tell me, did you kiss her? Did you kiss her? Kiss her? You know Okay? Kiss. It's not like I like her or anything. It's just a... Well, I... I understand. Now let's get that picture of a ghost. Hmm? Oh. <gasps> Here we go. Do I look scary? Do I even look kind of scary? Pretty spooky, huh? Don't you think? Well, not really. Your face is way too kind to be scary looking, I. I'm so sorry. Let's take a picture of Mai. She doesn't have the slightest bit of kindness in her anyway. <laughs> You're about to be dead, me. I have an idea. Let's get Maya to do it. I don't mind being ghostly. I am a spirit. I am dead. I am scary. <laughs> Yes, yes, you are. <laughs> Maya looks scarier than mine. I'm scared too. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Take the picture. Huh? Right. <laughs> That's not human, Mikey. That's bronze. Wait a second. I got a hunch. Anybody got a nickel? It's Jefferson. And that means... We caught the guy who swiped Jefferson's head. Looks more like he caught you. Thanks for leading me up here, kids. I couldn't for the life of me figure out where they put them dang lockers. You'll never get away with this, Raymond. Actually, I probably will, seeing as the statue of limitations on my crime runs out at midnight tonight. Limitations? I thought it was a statue of Jefferson. It means that after midnight, he can no longer be prosecuted for his crime. Oh. I'm gonna sell old Jeff here back to the town for 30 times what I asked for all them years ago. What did you ask for back then? Ten bucks and a head start. And now you want 30 times more? Whoa, that's nearly 300 bucks. 
Let my pals go, Raymond. It's me and Finn you should blame for tracking you down. Well, I'd like to let you youngins go, but I can't take that chance. You kids are going to be locked up in here for quite a while. I hope you brought plenty of snacks. You're a very bad man. And you're not much of a janitor either. Why, you little... You're not so fast, Raymond. Hey, look, it's Spinelli. And the school police. Earl Raymond, you're under arrest for the decapitation of a statue of the third president of the United States. But, but, but it's not how it looks. Tell it to the judge. By the way, he's a descendant of Jefferson. Ah, dang it. And I'd have gotten away with it, too, if it hadn't been for them meddling kids. Thanks, kids. Another eight hours, and he would have been off scot-free. Spinelli! you saved us i thought you said we were being stupid well you were coming up here without the authorities that and biff would never do that that and biff that means you read the barnabies well i might have casually glanced through volumes one through 64. hurry up ty i'm going as fast as i can it's your fault we're late hey i have to finish packing oh. What have you got in there anyway? Just camping essentials. Sleeping bag, flashlight, fondue set. Huh? What? Naomi likes fondue. Will you freaks get out of my way? I'm going to miss the bus. And we are not. I had to pick up my designer hiking shorts. Just because we're camping doesn't mean we have to dress like slobs. Obviously, you don't know what I'm talking about. Naomi! You're too late. The bus just left. It's all your fault. If you weren't in my way, I would have made it. Why'd you miss the bus? I forgot my permission slip. I was really looking forward to camping, too. Yeah. Oh, there's nothing like uh, roughing it in the great outdoors. No. Really? Ow! <laughs> I never pictured you as a nature lover. Are you kidding? <laughs> Roughing it is my specialty. I, you just call me Mr. Outdoors. Yeah. Well, camping's out, but at least I don't have to spend the weekend with you. I couldn't have said it better myself. Naturally. What do you know? It can get worse. Let's get inside before we get soaked. I mean you. Before you get soaked. I mean me. Me, I could stay out in this all day. <laughs> Oh, God. <laughs> Oops. Guess I didn't hear what I thought I heard. <laughs> Gotta work on that listening, Polly. <gasps> Can we see the new water park? Sorry, kiddo, but it won't be ready for a few weeks. Hmm. I know what we can do until the new water park opens. Mm, this is the life. Now we can be pruny year-round. That's a 300% increase in potential prune, and we can expect at least 26% wider wrinkles. <laughs> it's good to see you calculating again, Shawnee. 